Hey guys, Brandon here with Exotic Cars 19, and I apologize, it's been a while since I uploaded. I think like three weeks or something like that. Uh, usually I like to upload at least once a week or, or so, but uh, kind of been slacking. But I'm making it up to you guys. Um, I'm making this video, but I'm also going to be talking about some other videos I have planned that I think you guys will like. But uh, I'll do that while I'm driving just to uh, uh, burn less time. But let me just explain what I'm doing with this video. I've been uh, requested on three different videos to make this specific video, which is kind of another point of view driving, not so much first person point of view but just a point of view driving BRZ video again with a better view of the three pedals, the uh, the clutch, brake, and gas. And I got requested to do that about a year ago, or a little over a year ago, I made a, a uh, how to drive a manual transmission tutorial video. And obviously a kind of foot cam would have been helpful for that. And then a couple months ago, I made a video on how to rev match and heel toe, obviously that foot cam would have been very helpful for that. And then one time I just put like a GoPro on my head and went point of view driving. And on those three videos, people have asked for this one. So enough rambling, we're just gonna go on another drive, um, hopefully somewhat spiritedly, but there's a lot of cars out today. But anyway, we're just gonna go on a drive with the BRZ again. And uh, I don't know if I'm gonna edit different kind of clips with this uh, angle or just kind of show at the bottom right or bottom left of the screen at the same time. I don't really know. But we have this camera rolling, the foot cam, and then we have the camera behind just kind of to get a forward view. So uh, I'll do something with the footage to kind of put it together. But anyway, for now, let's go driving. And believe it or not, this is now the third attempt making this video because my foot cam uh, kept falling off. Spiritedly, if traffic will allow me. People have requested this. I, now, I pushed off making this video for a while because I didn't know how to get a GoPro down there while I'm driving. Uh, and so I'm using those sticky mounts and they keep freaking falling off. So hopefully that's a bad decline, but we're good. Uh, lower my car. Yeah, no, thank you. I barely made that one. Um, anyway, um, yeah, the sticky mount kept falling off. I think I found it. I mean, it hasn't fallen off for six minutes. So hopefully we can go another six to 10 minutes uh, without falling off. But. If you're watching this, that means I uploaded the video. If I uploaded it, it means it didn't fall off, so we're good. So let's uh, get to driving. Now, this isn't another tutorial video. I've already made a tutorial on how to drive manual, how to, uh, you know, uh, rev match and all that. So you can watch those videos and then apply what you're seeing with the foot cam here. But maybe some of you guys watching already know how to rev match. You're just, you just want to see me ramble in the BRZ for some weird reason. But anyway, uh, enough requests I figured I'd just do another driving video I never complain driving my BRZ so why not so back to what I was saying though uh, yeah it's been like three weeks since I uploaded and I do apologize for that just kind of busy around this time of the year in real estate uh, kind of a busy schedule and any free time I get I enjoy uh, so just the uploads haven't been coming uh, or being uh, you know as frequent as I would like to and if you guys notice if you guys are subscribers from just a couple months ago you guys noticed I started doing these videos called owning a and then insert the car I did this on a uh, on a Ferrari F430 a I believe 1973 Camaro Rally Sport, uh, an Audi S5, and so I get with an owner of a car, they sit uh, in the driver's seat, they do the driving, I'm in the passenger seat, and this camera is just on the windshield with the suction cup, and recording kind of me asking the owner questions on what it's like owning their car, kind of how long they've owned it, what they've owned before, yada, 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 and you guys seem to enjoy that, and I really enjoy making those videos. They're easy to edit, they're fun to make, it's all fun. I've been wanting to make a lot more videos like that, but you guys wouldn't believe how hard it is to just get people scheduled. Let me go around this guy. Uh, it's so hard to get those videos scheduled. Some people say they want to make those videos and then you try to touch bases with them and then they ignore you or whatever. But um, I've kind of pushed those off for a little uh, while while I was busy with other things, but now I have some more free time. And so today is... What, what day is it today? I think it's Wednesday. Uh, this Sunday, I'm going to be uploading, I'm sorry, not uploading, I'm going to be filming another one of those videos with a C7 Z06. So that's an exciting car. Uh, I've brought to you guys a lot of videos with my dad's C7 Stingray, but I haven't really uploaded a video on a C7 Z06 unless it was like just me filming the startup and exhaust or a track day. So a owning a C7 Z06 video will be coming very soon. I'll be filming it on Sunday. If I could film it, edit it, and upload it on Sunday, that'd be very nice and impressive. But expect that video hopefully Monday. Um, I don't expect that guy to uh, you know stand me up like that. He seems pretty cool. So um, that should be pretty exciting. Another one of those videos. 
because uh, the video I did on the Ferrari F430 is doing pretty well, so that's exciting. I uh, got a few subscribers from that one. I think we're at like 22, maybe, thousand views or something like that, so that's pretty cool. So there's definitely interest in those kind of videos. They're not like overly produced and edited. They're very simple and just fun to make. I get to meet cool owners, so hopefully we can get the ball rolling with those kind of videos. You know, like everyone's kind of got their niche. Matt Farrow with his one takes and Petrolicious with their very, very cinematic videos. And hopefully I can just do those very easy, uh, kind of in between those things. I don't have to do the driving, just kind of interviewing, but not like formally interviewing, just kind of talking to owners about their cars. I, I just, I think that's kind of cool. So hopefully uh, after the C7 uh, Z06, that could be uh, kind of a gateway to doing some other cool cars as well. But yeah, he's, he seems pretty excited about it and kind of in exchange for that, I'll also do like a photo shoot and send him all the high resolution pictures that you guys can expect to see on the Instagram, Exotic Cars 19. Um, so yeah, I've been starting to upload some more kind of hopefully higher quality pictures on there. Last year throughout 2016, I was uploading like four pictures a day on Exotic Cars 19's Instagram. And I was kind of sacrificing quality just for quantity. Uh, this year though, it's changed a bit. I'm kind of just going for, it uh, uh, looks like school's getting out here. But uh, I'm more uploading just a couple times a week and hopefully just kind of more uh, higher quality pictures. So expect to see some nice pictures of a, uh, of a red C7Z06 uh, soon, hopefully. But uh, anyway, uh, that's exciting news. But like I said, hopefully that could be a gateway to some more videos down the line because I really do like making those videos. Speaking of which, uh, I know I'm probably reaching out to a very small audience here, but if you are an Austin viewer, you have a car that uh, you'd like to feature in one of those kind of owning videos, and I'm not picky with these. I don't. It doesn't need to be an exotic or anything like that. Just uh, anything uh, that people just might like to watch or anything like that. Uh oh, someone's getting pulled over. Uh, anyway, uh, but if you guys are an Austin viewer or willing to travel to Austin, you want to make a video like that, you're just driving your car, I'm asking you questions in the passenger seat if you don't mind that, then uh, send uh, send me a message or just leave a comment. I'll, I'll reach out to you and we can make a cool video. But I'd like to upload some more videos like that. to drive really spiritedly on this very nice uh, road seeing someone get pulled over just back there uh, I'll, uh, I'll keep a lookout I'll try to keep it kind of light but uh, like I said this is just kind of uh, in case some of the people out there that were watching the tutorial on how to drive manual or rev match maybe this point of view might help them a little bit you can kind of see uh, back to what I was saying on the rev matching video how I'm not really using my heel and toe on a heel toe downshift I'm just kind of splitting my foot in two. Uh, but yeah, like I said, this isn't another tutorial. If you guys uh, want that, I already made that video. You could kind of just apply that new angle to that. But we're just kind of driving for fun here. But just a little bit of explanation there. Clutch in into fifth with some blip of the throttle. Clutch, blip, throttle back into fourth. And kind of some more. And then do it again to third. No braking there. a good thing about a catch up to traffic. Uh, I really don't want a speeding ticket today. Into sixth, we'll just let it cruise. This is a fun road, but uh, I've been uh, given a little heart attack many times coming around a corner and seeing uh, police cars. So I've, I've been lucky so far though. I'm coming to the end of this road here. Probably call it good from there. Uh, sorry guys, I wish I could drive a little bit more, you know, spiritedly, but just uh, too many cars out today and whatnot, but probably gonna pull in here and get some gas. But anyway, just kind of a random video. You guys requested kind of the uh, foot cam and the GoPro didn't fall off, so uh, how lucky is that? I get to upload a video again. 
Uh, but anyway, like I said, guys, Sunday I will be filming a uh, another video, another owning one, uh, owning video with a uh, C7Z06, um, and hope that I get to upload it either then or Monday. So stay tuned for that. And in this last three weeks since I haven't uploaded, I looked at the channel and we're near 15,000 subscribers. So I'm really, really uh, grateful for that. So thank you guys so much for the support. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Anyway, see you on the next one.